Here we're gonna talk about the TH sound. So all of us make um, all the mistakes with this TH sound. So basically we can pronounce the TH as th or as th, like voiced sound or voiceless sound. So what's the difference between a voiced sound and a voiceless sound? We took it in the P and B, remember? So a voice sound will make your vocal cords vibrate. So put your hand on your vocal cords, your throat like this, and say zzzz. Can you feel the vibration? Of course, so this is a voice sound. And this one here, the th, put your hand like this, say th. Can you feel any vibration? No, so this is voiceless. So to make the things so super easy and so clear, the, the best or the um, very easy rule for this sound to produce it correctly is to show me your tongue. Whether it's voiced or voiceless, you must show me your tongue. For example, this word here. This is breathe. Breathe. You must show me your tongue. This one, breath breath get that so you must always show me your tongue when you're practicing your pronunciation it's always better to exaggerate to produce the sound super strong that will help you to uh, master and practice your pronunciation so for example this is this this thin this thin show me your tongue very essential this is there, there, and thank you, thank you. So how can we practice, guys? I want you to stand in front of a mirror and say, for example, this word or this word, there, and repeat it for like 10 times. And every time, make sure that you are seeing your tongue. There, thank you. So whether it's voiced or voiceless, I must see your tongue. Got that guys? Okay, so that was the TH sound, the voiced and the voiceless. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section and I'll see you next video.